Good morning, it's Saturday the 7th of April 2022, so I'm down at the unit again and I now have in my possession one small box from China. So if I open this up with one hand And there we have a fuel cutoff relay, hopefully, by Shundeng in. So we're going to fit that to the bike and then we're going to see if it will start. So I'll put this on the bike and I'll be back in two. Right, the relay is now plugged in there. And the water is topped up with no leaks so far. So I'm going to stick some petrol in it and then uh, we will connect the battery and see if it'll start. Right, so I put some petrol in and I turned the tap and then petrol started pissing out. So I hope that's not bloody blocked up, but there was nothing in here. Um, so petrol's just spewing out of there. So I think I need to empty the re-empty the petrol, take the petrol cap tap off and see what the crack is. Right, so all I did was um, waggle this and then all of a sudden that started filling up with petrol. But but I think this pipe is too too strong for the clamp to hold it onto that, that smooth bit of the fuel filter. So what I'm gonna have to do I think is take this bit of pipe off here take the fuel filter off <coughs> and then join that pipe directly to the pump there um, so I'll do that first right the petrol fire, the petrol tap doesn't turn off so wh whichever way you turn it there's petrol still coming out so I'm having to drain it down so I shall drain that back into the tank I don't know how long this is going to take because I put most of that bloody petrol in um, and then I need to get that little pipe off there and then put that on on, so I'll be back in two minutes. Right, so um, I've now got rid of the fuel filter, so I'm hoping that there's petrol down there now. Cause I, like I say, I don't think that works, but we will uh, see. And I've only put a bit. I've only put a bit in. Last time I filled it up, I'm not going to put that much in. So what I'll do is I'll. Leave that as it is, because petrol seems to be coming out with that set like that. So I'm only assuming now that petrol's gone round there, and it's in there somewhere. Um, obviously, I've still got this fucking wire to sort out. Um, so I need to do something with that. Um, but all I'm going to do is just plug that back in for now. I brought the little lanes manual down just to see where that top wire goes. Looking like this don't fucking spark and blow up or something. So anyway, um, the object of today is just to see if the bike will start. So we've no water leaks. Um, there's petrol in it. Now the carbs do need balancing. That's 100 percent So it might start. It might cough and splutter. I don't know, but we'll see anyway. So I'll put the battery on and we'll give it a go. Right. So after a bit of fucking about, I got the battery on because I was a screw short. So I've got that sorted. Have a nick to it off the Thunder Ace battery. Come here! Um, oh, look at that. The oil light's now working. So that oil switch I put on has sorted that out. But... I didn't hear the fuel pump. Shit. 
So I'm going to try and start it. Right, I need to undo one of the um, float balls, see if there's petrol in there. If there isn't, then there's still something wrong with this. Right, there's something wrong with this electrical circuit, even though I've put a new um, relay on and there's a brand new pump, it's still not fucking having it. So what I've done is, I've just fashioned up this to try and get some fuel in. It's trickling in slowly, so I need to raise that a bit higher. Um, I don't know why it ain't doing it. So let's uh, let's see if it goes through when I start cranking engine over. Right, I need to work out why there's no fucking fuel in that now. Just two minutes. Lay down. Come, lay down. Right, I've been on with this fucking thing now for about two or three hours and I'm pissed off with it. It's going on eBay tonight. Um, it backfired, refusing to start. I think I don't even think there's a fucking spark anymore. So this is going on fucking eBay. I'm pissed off with it. So I'm going to take some pictures and then uh, put it on. <laughs> 